<laughs> okay, hi people! So we're on our way to the 4D. Wait, 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 wait. Hi YouTube. Yeah, we're on our way to the 4D slash 5D slash HD ultrasound. Oh, the window's down, so maybe Triple loud. HD, 8K. What's we're so tired because my sister got married yesterday, so no makeup today. And I'm like sweating because I'm so nervous, excited. We have booked like the premium package, which is like an hour long because it gives you time to, if like your baby's in a hard position to see. And then it also comes with a stuffed animal that you put their heartbeat in, like the sound of their heartbeat, you know. And then, um, what else? You get like a DVD full or a CD full of pictures and videos. Why do my cheeks look so chubby? And then also like a bunch of printed out pictures. So we're gonna go see what she looks like. I am 30 weeks pregnant. Today's Monday, I'm 30 weeks pregnant. And then on Friday, I'll be 31 weeks pregnant. Anyways, we're kind of rushing. So we're basically pulling in though. I was glad to have them. Were they? Yeah, they, they, they were great. Yeah. And, um, we, um, you know, it was a little more stressful than I thought. Not yesterday. We went to a wedding day. Because before. of the. It, oh, really? That sucks, yeah. but yeah. so we'll have to work around it a little bit. But you can still see. What does that mean? Yeah. It's, it just means that it's it's. Wow. Maddie, what do you think over there? And again, there? that's uh, just a piece of the cord uh, going across yep, the nose right there. So you can see her. Oh, she's and got I'm a just, cute little. Like, kind of looks like me. What do you think, Mom? Underneath the nose and the lip. Glenn, what do you it's think? Looks like me or Maddie? It's hard to tell. It's almost hard to tell. It almost looks like she's looks like a baby. sucking out of <laughs> Looks like a baby. She's not positioned right. that much right now. Yeah, at this point. At this point. So that's normal to be head down at this time? Yeah, that's, that's, that's what you want. want. That's exactly what you want. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you don't want to so coming up first. Yeah. So and now the cord is floated up a little bit higher. It's okay. going across the eye. So it's messing up my picture a little bit. Yeah. Okay. See it going oh, right yeah. across the eye. Oh, she's got cute little lips, too. She has such cute lips. Well, I got your lips. Yeah. Oh, look at it. Look at her. Oh, she. Oh! Put her lip in. It's so wild. Huh? Can I get a thumbs up? That's amazing. Isn't that Give crazy? Or do you suck your thumb? Babies can suck their thumb in the womb, right? You can. Yeah, That's crazy. That Is that her left hand coming around? or That's, That's her foot. That's now. her other foot sticking on the feet? other side? No, that's her, this is... Underneath that, I thought I saw her toe. Okay, her so here is her that's foot. Fine. Yeah. That's her toe right yeah. there. It's the bottom yeah. of her foot. This okay. is her full time. Okay. okay. This is a piece of cord going okay. across here, and okay. I tried to cut it out the best I could, yep. but... Yep, yep. Your signal, whatever you do. Oh. Oh, look at that. Hello, cheeks. Yeah, say that. Well done. Yeah, that's right. That's a little um, not genetic. That's yeah. a little, you know, <laughs> yeah. There's not enough to do it. Okay. But it just depends. I, this Position machine person. needs a lot less than what the old ones did, uh, so I get a lot more with a lot less. Okay. So. How's um, Maddie's fluid? Is she? Good. Yeah. Okay. Maddie's really good with her water. Look at that bottom lip. Great lips. <laughs> okay. Hi, guys. It's like two days later um, after the 40 ultrasound. I wanted to make that a vlog, like I said, but I didn't really know like what else to add to it. So I figured I'm just going to make it like a short little vlog. Um, we've been like, well, not we. Chris is back to work, but I... <laughs> I've been kind of resting a lot. Like I've still been like doing what I need to do as in like cleaning our house, but also like trying to rest a lot because my body's just kind of like, but I don't know. It's just, it's fine. Like I don't want to be like, oh, it's hurting or like, you know, but it's fine. But I just needed to probably take it a little easier. So. I've rested for the past 
really need to scoot back. <laughs> I've rested a lot and like tried to like sleep more. And anyways, but today is Tuesday or Wednesday. No, today's Wednesday. And our furniture is coming today, today and tomorrow. So today we have our um, nightstands coming. And then we also have um, our dresser coming, which wasn't supposed to come, but on my email it says that it's coming. So it's like 1.30 and the shipment, from, it's from City Furniture, the delivery. It should get here between like two and five. And then I do have a chiropractor appointment today. I've been going every week now, which I think has helped me a lot, but my body's still like pretty sore. She's like really low in me, so I kind of feel like that's why I have a lot of like soreness. And now I get a lot of like twinges in my like lower stomach. So I kind of feel like it's because she's pretty low in me. But um, yeah, that's what's going on today. Yesterday I never I did not do my makeup. I feel like I like wanna get in a better habit of doing my makeup because it makes me feel good. But um yeah. It's been so busy with like my sister getting married and everything and so much family in town. And now it's January. It's already like January 9th. Like what? And we have Chris's birthday is January 15th, he's turning 23. And then January 16th, the next day, is my shower. And I realized, literally all today, like, holy crap, I don't have a dress. So, I'm going to order a dress online to save myself from, like, running around town trying to find a dress that I'm probably not going to find because I pretty much, like, need it maternity at this point. A lot of clothes don't fit me. I'm, like, I keep running through my closet and like all the clothes that don't fit me I'm like storing in the nursery closet right now because our closet's not that big and given Chris like most of our closet I don't know anyways that's a different story but but yeah and then I realized I really need to get my hair done I got my hair cut like three four months ago but it's growing so long and it kind of looks ombre which I really don't like um, and I think I want to go back blonde. So I'm trying to book a full balayage with a blowout and a haircut. I'm thinking I want to take off just like a healthy trim, two inches. Should probably do three to be honest, but I think I'm just going to do two inch haircut, maybe three. I don't know. And then I want to add some more like face framing. I think I'm comparing like old pictures when I got my hair done and seeing what I like the best. Um, and I know that this, the time I liked my hair the best, it was actually cut straight across and it was like a, well, it was already blonde, so it was a partial balayage, but, but I'd pretty much get a full balayage. I don't know. Anyways, really need to touch with that. And like I said, it's like January 9th and I want my hair done for Chris's birthday and my baby shower. So I texted my girl and I'm really hoping she can fit me in. And what else? Yeah, I'm just trying to get like more organized with especially our clothes in our bedroom. Our bedroom's been like the main thing that has taken a long while to get organized because we've been waiting for this furniture. So I'm really excited the furniture's coming today. I'm gonna go, my chiropractor is at three o'clock and they can come with the furniture anytime between two and five. So let's hope they don't come while I'm gone. But yeah, I showered and just in like making myself feel good. I like to scrub and I actually feel pretty good right now. Um, I might as well make this like a little pregnancy update too. I haven't, I'm not organized, I haven't written anything down, but I'm 30 weeks in like four days. I think Friday, today's Wednesday, so Friday I'll be around five days, 30 weeks in five days, I don't know. Uh, Friday, I'll be 31 weeks. We had the 40 ultrasound. Um, she weighs three pounds, 15 ounces, which I don't know if I'm stupid, but I did not realize that, that like there's 16 ounces in a pound. Is that it? I don't know. But she's basically four pounds and I'm 30, 31 weeks, which I'm like, wow. So that is a little bigger. So now I'm kind of like, oh, are you gonna have a big baby? <laughs> But, um, but it's funny because my belly's measuring like a week or two behind, 
which is not like a big deal. It's nothing to be like alarmed about. It's totally normal. It just means like she might be sitting in me. I think it's transverse, which is like left to right. I think transverse is left to right. Which would mean I'm getting wider rather than like out, but I don't feel like I'm getting wider. It's all normal, so yeah. But she's three pounds, 15 ounces. Heart rate was like 425 or 125. I Maybe I have pregnancy brain right now, or 145. Or is it 400? Dude, I do not know. 145? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna say I have pregnancy brain. But, um, what else? I still feel good. Like, I've had a great pregnancy. I feel good. But, I don't want to complain. But, like, it's definitely, I've had to rest more the past couple days. Maybe just after being so busy. I just have a lot. Like, walking was, like, really hard. I've had a lot, a lot of soreness in my lower stomach. And, yeah. I did notice today, today's, like I said, the day 100 times, that I have like a couple stretch marks on my stomach. So I know I should not care, but I do a little bit because I didn't care. Like I have stretch marks on my under boob. Don't really care about that. I don't even see it. And then I have stretch marks on my thighs, which I didn't really care about because I got stretch marks on my thighs when I hit puberty and they totally went away. So like never bothered me but getting them on my stomach does bother me a little but I know it shouldn't so it's okay but I've just been taking such good care I was hoping that I maybe wouldn't they're really small like I could show you you probably wouldn't even notice them but um of course I do notice them let me show you I guess my belly does look big I feel like it is not that big it's getting hard to see right here. But yeah, like there's several. They're like tiger stripes. This side there's like one, two. And this side there's like several stripes. So my belly button is definitely popped a lot more. I guess this is my bum shot. 30, 31 weeks. It doesn't feel big. To be honest, it doesn't even feel like it's grown that much. But my belly button does pop more and more like every day. So I guess it is. I'm not organizing my thoughts and this is almost a 10 minute clip. I don't know what else to say. Sleeping. I mean, it's fine, kind of the same. Maybe getting a little harder. Not really, it's fine. Sleep is fine. I wake up every couple hours to go to the bathroom. Totally fine, used to it. And then, I feel like my hardest times are in the mornings because it's hard for me to like get, it's not hard for me to get out of bed. Like I want to get out of bed honestly because I'm normally uncomfortable or like my neck hurts or something from having to lay on my side. I'm a belly sleeper and it's getting harder. Oh, yeah, I look kind of crazy. I didn't get to finish my makeup, but that is city furniture coming right now. So they're early. I'm so excited. This is, oh wait, here's a bump shot here. I have no idea how much weight I've gained. I'm kind of not paying attention to it because at this point, like, I don't know. I do feel a little self-conscious and I just don't want to pay too much attention to it. But I feel like I look great. But anyways, yeah, that's the furniture, people. So I'm just going to end that little pregnancy update there. I don't really know how well I just explained all of that because my mind's just not that sharp. But yeah, this is what the room looks like before. So the people came, I'm just showing you guys what I'm eating for lunch real quick because I really need to eat. Um, look at how good this looks. So this is a bagel, it's the Dave's Killer Bread Bagel. They're like a lot healthier and they're really good. And then I put cheese and then I put two different types of cheese. I put like, I don't know what type of cheese the first one is. <laughs> and then mozzarella and tomatoes and spinach. A little bit of pesto and yum. That's gonna take forever to cook though, but also got two Amazon packages. But let me show you how it, what it looks like. It looks so good. You really like, we really thought like all of our furniture was not gonna fit in here. It was gonna look so cramped, but it doesn't at all. 
I kind of hate how the carpet is like half on half off but now all we have to do is remount the TV on that wall but I love it the dresser's like skinny but it still like holds so much room it's a very very nice dresser it's all from city furniture who would definitely recommend there's Chris's nightstand so now I need to organize them like get some organizationals there's really not much I want to keep in them besides like a charging station I gave Chris this because this he can plug his like Apple watch charger into and then this is to charge like his um, their gun and then a phone charger he does keep a bat by the bed which I love but these drawers are just empty there's really not anything I don't want to like get them cluttered you know but now I get to organize all of our clothes oh my goodness I have these drawer dividers I'm so excited to use and we shoved this old dresser in here for now um but if we don't use it then I'm gonna take it out might put it in the nursery um, closet I don't know but I won't need to do some like extreme closet cleaning and organizing but I think I need more like organizational pieces and then what I realize I'm gonna do is move the rocking chair into here because I'm gonna need it I think the rocking chair is in the nursery but I have the room I have the space right here and I'm gonna need it so we're gonna remount that TV all over there then bassinet goes right by my bedside and then I think I want to move the mirror here and then keep the rocking chair there. Or I'll just put the rocking chair right there. And we really need wall hangings. Oh my goodness. Honestly, for our whole home, we need wall hangings. Like right here, this wall is empty. Right here, I don't like this mirror here. It's a mess because I had to move this for the movers. But yeah, tomorrow we're getting our chairs, our side tables, and our coffee table. Or coffee, yeah, coffee table. Anyways, I think that's it. I still have not finished my makeup. I probably should, but I'm just gonna end the video now because I have talked a lot. So I feel like it's good to end it now. Um, I don't really know when my next video will be. I've kind of been resting. Oh, maybe it'll be my baby shower. Maybe I'll film that. It probably will, or Chris's birthday, but I cannot wait to get my hair done. Oh my goodness. I need a chop in color. I do not like the ends. Anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.